Hey guys, it's Brian Dog here. It's a rainy day, so we're gonna try to look through a few coins. I went to a bank that I've never went through before. They kind of changed around the banks that are open on Saturday in my area, so I had to slide through one that I've never went to before. But uh, they wouldn't let me get a lot. But they let me get some, and uh, on the quarters I got $200 worth. Ten rolls are bank rolled. Ten rolls are customer wrap rolls. I figure we'd do a little battle comparison to see which one yields the best. Stick around. We'll see what we find. Since we're working on quarters, I'll get out my state book. Still got a few places to fill in for it. Still have a few to fill in in the national parks, but just a few of the early years. Here we go. Bank rolled versus customer rolled. What's y'all's opinion? I have to say, I I'm all for the bank rolled, but here lately customer rolled stuff has been paying off. We're going to get into these and see which one yields the best. We're trying to fill these final slots on our national parks and state quarter book. So, yeah, let's get into it. Just right off the rip, roll number one. Customer rolled. Someone done slipped me a nickel in there. Come on now. So, down 20 cents. <laughs> Baby, what are you doing? Daddy's trying to look at coins. <laughs> we don't want to play. Alright. Having to get back in on roll number one. Just roll one. Got the S mint. Clark, 2017. Wow. Roll one's being good to me. Twenty twelve. Acadia. That's one I've been needing. Let's put it in the book. Nice. I tell you, they got me on that nickel, but so far, this thing's doing good. I still got half a roll to go. Unbelievable. Hey, and after going through it and realizing the nickel was actually extra, we got 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Nine, and we put number 10 in the book. Nice. Now I wanted to mention that with the new quarters, there are known to be some errors. We're gonna keep those to the side. We'll look at them better later, but just wanted to say this Colorado is just a pee, but Pretty good shape. On to roll number two. American Park. Come on, I hope it's a W. Already. Number two is being good to me. Look at this. Oh, 
Oklahoma. That's one of the last few we need. Uh, nice. That's nice right there. Plenty to go. And one thing I wanted to mention about customer roles is if you act right, you can just reuse the roll, which is pretty nice. But the bank gives me plenty, but when it's a good roll, you can just reuse it. Yeah, results from roll number two, only a couple new ones. Or I say no, 2021, George Washington, on to roll three. Roll three is doing a little something early. Ecuador, got a little foreign action going on. Nice. Roll three. Bicentennial. Yeah, I remember. I remember as a kid. Bicentennials and half dollars had my interest. Nice. Back in on roll three. Not the bicentennial. On the roll four. Already at first sight, roll four. First initial look. Buy something else. Roll four, doing big things. Got the new Washington. The P Puerto Rico. That's one that I need for the book. Nice. Be nice to be able to get this thing complete. Can't believe that. Been looking for these things for a while. I might have to put some kind of marker beside the rolls that had one for the book so far. One, two, and roll four. Still on row four, but it's just a P. Yep, Mark. Tennessee, but. Tell it hasn't saw much action at all. Number five might have some tricks up its sleeve. Bicentennial Ender. Roll five. Customer wrap. D mint mark. They say some might have double die liberty, but that doesn't do it. Yeah, no double die. Looks like someone might have busted his nose. Blood everywhere. <laughs> Them red. Either way, nice way to start row row five. Row five. Someone done slipped a nickel in there. 
at the moment. Not sure if I'm up or down, but yo, come on now. Roll five, get this. We're all good condition. State parks. Real shiny. Still on roll five, but just wanted to show this off. 77 with some nice black, I guess, toning going on. Starting to affect the back. I like these, I like, like the rainbow toned and different tone you can find. So keep it to the side also. Yeah, I'm with doing the math this time. The nickel was replacing a quarter. So, got robbed. You robbed me, boy. On the row, row six. Customer wraps. Roll six. Just turning up some of the newer stuff. Here we go. Bring on roll seven. Old, old regular ender. Come on. Roll seven, come on again. Nickel. Might have to track down who turned these things in. <laughs> Roll sevens. Got a few nice black tones. I like them. Roll seven. Again? Really? Roll seven. Got some newer stuff. A couple times, but I got robbed on the nickels. I guess that's one of the risk of customer rolled. It slipped something wrong in there that, that won't happen on those bank rolls. But here we go. On to number eight. First glance of this number eight. This thing's real shiny. Just a P. P net mark. Open as a W R S. Nice. I like it though. Roll eight. Giving us a bicentennial. Really? Come on. Roll eight. Keep the action moving. Oh, none. Don't really seem special at first sight. Come on, I know there's something good in there. Boy, 
say. Let's roll nine. Repeat mint mark. Nebraska. Very good shape. Getting toward the end of roll nine, but bicentennial. I just wanted to say too that when you're looking at those, it's not circulated hard. I mean, looking at the edge is a good way because there's like two in there. Overall, it was real nice, but they had some scratches. But that's usually how you can spot them just by looking at the edge. Here we go. Last but not least. Roll number 10 of the customer wrap rolls. What? All W's? Nah. <laughs> Roll 10. Gives me one that has been... hiding from me for a long time it's not in the best shape but D mint mark Minnesota that's the last one needed to fill up that page on the book I was gonna find you. Number 10. Yeah, Bicentennial. D Mint Mark. Last roll. Number 10 goes out with a bang. S Mint. You can always tell those S mints extra shiny. Hey, I'm happy with that. So, there's pretty much the results of our customer wrapped rolls. I went ahead and put a half dollar beside the ones that gave us something for the book. Overall, that's pretty good, just out of 10 rolls. Can't wait to see what these bank rolls are going to turn up. Stay tuned. Right, let's get underway on these bank rolls. Nothing out like catching on that, on the enders, but... present you don't know what's inside now, see how I was saying when you look at those edges you can kind of see oh yeah that's a shiny George Washington that's kind of the plus of Oh boy, what we got? Maya Angelo. Yeah, those edges kind of give it away. As they get really circulated, they start looking rough. Wow, I was, thought I was done with the edges, but... That edge looks a little funny. Holy cow, 
1960. Yes, sir. This is special to me because this is my first silver D Mint Mark. This is my first I've found. I found a W. I found several other nice things, but this is my first silver. Yeah, roll one of, of the bank rolls is looking nice. Roll one on the bank roll. Don't give us a bicentennial too. On the roll two. I'll tell you that roll one. That made me happy. On the roll two. And peeled back the way it's ready to go. We got a new one, Ender. Mm, it'd be nice to see that look of silver again. But looks like some new looking stuff. y'all in if there's anything good I took a peek at this one but so I put it back in just to show y'all I mean look at how nice that edge looks this actually come on Right, but 1985P. Got a little bit of wear going on, but not much. Unbelievable. Took her off some good quality. Not perfect, but considering it's 1980. Not bad considering they're usually trashed. Too. A couple new guys and a couple old guys that's got that shine. Oh, roll three of the bank rolls. American Park Ender, come on. Let's get a W, that's really what I'm what I've been wanting. Definitely a few fresh looking ones there. <laughs> Not a W, but wow. Someone was mad at this guy. Drug it through the concrete or what? <laughs> Roll three. Only had a few new boys. So on to roll four of the bank rolls. No special ender.
definitely seeing some new shine there. Let's see what we got. Yeah, roll forward in the bank rolls. P mint mark. Tennessee. Uh, overall in great condition. Easy to spot with that nice edge. It's worth hanging on to. It's one nice condition on state. A few newer on roll four. So on the roll five. shiny edges there. Roll five's got this overall nice condition. Peeving out Wisconsin. Okay, let's keep it moving. Roll six. Still on roll six and our first bicentennial in a while. Centennial and a few newer quarters on roll six on the roll seven. Shining looking ender there. Roll seven only gave off some newer ones. So here we go on the roll eight. Take a look at roll eight enders. Got a new new on one side, old on the other. A few looking new up in there. Arizona. It's a P mint mark. I'm actually still looking for the D, but it's in really good shape. Another state quarter. I already got it, but this thing's in pretty good shape. on the front but nice one more little something roll eight pretty shiny bicentennial nice 
Nice. Hard to say, roll eight. Sounds some nice. Nice quality coins. So, nine and ten left to go. Silver. Okay. My Angelo is looking nice. Got a Washington that's got a nice toning. I had to say on the bankroll side. I didn't see much Tona. Yeah, I'll take a look at this out of roll 10. 1985, too. Looks like it's got a cut on that edge. Sometimes you can find them rolled over. D mint mark. Can't wait to get a good coin microscope. What's the best one? What should I get? Roll 10 said it's not done yet. P mint mark. Indiana. This thing's in it's in really good condition for 20 years old. That nice shine on the edge. Okay, so that's all for roll 10. Some shinies. Got some tone. Cud error. Crossing the Delawares. Maya Angelo. Tuskegee Airmen. So, overall, the bankroll did pretty good. I had to say, customer roll did good also. Right. That was 
fun. We had our 10 rolls of the customer wrap rolls. We had 10 rolls of the bank wrap rolls. And in my honest opinion, it's got to be a tie. Customer wrap rolls, you had what, two S mounts, you had a foreign. Yeah, just several, several nice toned. Had uh, kind of more bicentennials on the customer side, but honestly, to me, on the bank wrap side, getting that silver on the first roll, it's unheard of. I've never found a silver quarter in circulation in my whole life. Yeah. It's, uh, it's pretty nice. I found all the other silvers but not a quarter and uh honestly on the bank side a lot of stuff seemed to be in nicer condition not as many bicentennials but hey silver i'll take silver any day bring it on matter of fact if you got any silver you don't want just let me know i'll help you get it off your hands <laughs> Well, much love if y'all made it this far and you're new. I hope you consider subscribing. We're going to start trying to get better at these. And uh, just keep searching to keep seeing what we can find. Uh, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Much love, y'all. Peace.